video I want to demonstrate for the Fax Aria cell sorter, what you would do if um, you filled up all your uh, cleaning tanks, your ethanol tank, your Fax Clean or 10% bleach tank, and your water tank, and you know everything's connected properly and full, but when you come into your Diva software, you see that it's reading that one of your tanks is actually empty. Um, this has happened several times to me over the past couple years, um, and what I've found is that the the sensor uh, frequently can, can go out on these things. So let's take a look at one of these sensors. Uh, it basically has um, a float at the bottom so that when the float uh, is in a container full of fluid, this, this uh, float portion will raise. What happens then is that will complete the circuit um, and the machine will read that the tank is full through this connector. Uh, this line is where the, the fluid passes through, and this line is just the circuit telling the machine that, there's, uh, that it's full when the float is in the up position. So a lot of times what happens is, if this is in the bleach tank, for example, um, what can happen is just through corrosion, you can, uh, it cannot register that it's in the up position. Um, and so what I found is a, a way to sort of bypass that is to actually um, just modify this thing so that you um, cut off the electronic part and if you cut this off you'll see that there are um, two wires inside here, a black and a red wire. And so um, what I've done <clears throat> to modify these is just uh, strip the wire with, um, you can just use um, wire strippers like these uh, or you can even just use a razor blade if you don't have wire strippers and you can artificially complete the circuit just by um, <clears throat> connecting these two wires, twisting them together, and if you had a little wire cap you could put that on there, or, or in my case I'm just going to use a little bit of electrical tape to tape that connection up. So once that's uh, fully taped, now you can just come over to your system uh, unplug the one that's not registering anymore and just plug in your new one that you've just um, that you've just fused the wires together and now if you come over to your software you're gonna see that now it's reading that all the tanks are full. Um, I found that this is really useful um, especially because um, when you do things like the aseptic sort command uh, to clean the machine or you do any priming of the tanks after refill, uh, if those aren't full, it won't allow you to do those commands. So you have to have a functioning sensor for that to work. Um, and those sensors cost about $200 um, new from BD, and so I found that it's just not worth it. Those tanks almost never actually go empty on me because I change them once a month when I uh, sterilize the instrument. So I, I never run low on water or fax clean or ethanol. Um, so this is kind of a quick uh, and easy trick to save yourself $200 in the case that your sensor uh, malfunctions.